show the assembly of uh, the chair for Xavier, for Professor X. I don't have the figure, but I have Gambit, which is the same size, so um, I don't know if I would be showing this to anyone, because I I'm making this for myself, because I will be sending this. So this is a recording in case someone needs help putting this up from the print files. Uh, the way you print them, uh, there should be a docu documentation if I do place them, uh, def make the files available, there should be a documentation. But uh, this is assuming you, you printed those parts. So the orientation of the print is important, so uh, this all fits uh, if you use exactly the settings that I told you uh, to, to use. So uh, this side here is assembled, this side is, as you can see, not. So there are a few smaller parts here, over here. Uh, so this is a bar like this and you just slide this thing here. You sh it's good to help with so something small like this to make sure it slides all the way can push this part here. There is a red part inside and this is also printed. So you will have to, to make sure that the angle is correct. And you just place this here and push this all the way. It can be tight at first, but this is basic how you do it. There are two parts like this. This is the top half of the light. So the best way is to place it like this and then push so it's positioned like this uh, this is the bottom part make sure you know you have the angle correct so it's like this it's all made to click if you want you can secure it with glue but it should hold the way it is and this is a part that goes inside you may need to cut this part I made a small cut here so the width is is better because the, the printed width is sometimes there there are very small uh, very small changes I mean they're very small uh, tolerances so uh, sometimes it could be better just to cut this thing to make it fit better a little better as you can see this thing it's well the part just flew off but I got it so once again uh, to make proper wraps I was doing it at the wrong angle because one angle is wider than the other I mean one side so again I know this fits because I did it already uh, and I just disassembled this for the video so let's see it was very easy to do before so I guess this mu must be the angle I am at so let's put one part in and then try to push the rest and I think it should go okay it's, it's in you can help yourself with a finger or with something sharp so as you can see those parts are in I will make a small push with this just to make sure that it's all the way or just oh, better yet use this so because the sharp needle part can scrape the surface and this goes here oh, sorry goes here like this so you just push it here you can you can help yourself by pushing this along the floor so it's all the way in so like this it's not all the way in and now, as you can see, when you push it like this, it's secure. So, those two parts are done. So, now let's move to this part. This is a base, and the, uh, there's the sliding mechanism here. So, you just have to... It may be stiff at first, so you, can, you may need to use some force. So, you just put this like this. This part is here, and you just slide it up. Uh, I just put it like on the floor like this and slightly hit it so that it goes all the way the same with this put this like this here and just 
slide it all the way because I've done this a few times it's it's going in rather smoothly but at first it was very hard so I had to use quite a bit of force to make it go all the way this black part here is the cover for the front so you just there is a groove here and you just place it like this so it's connected uh, this is the back part so you, you may place this uh, like this this has a better finish but you can also place it like this so that there is a like a hole like a space inside I think I will use this part for now because just this side looks better and now you connect this like this so it's also quite tight to hold everything so better it's better to plug in one part. Oh, okay. So maybe this first. So this is a chair back back side of the chair. It can be slid up or down. I will place it all the way down for this video. And this is the second part that goes in here. And you can use this to put a wire here to secure the figure more. Like this. Make sure it goes all the way. Okay, it's in. Now you put those parts, one part here, and to put the other one, push so that this part is all the way in. So let's make sure it's all aligned. It's not very hard to do, but to show you this and to film, it's a lot harder. Okay, so it's all in. Uh, if those parts are slid all the way, there should be no gap here. So you have a, if you have a gap here, that means that this thing has to slide a bit more to the base. So this is it. Uh, this part here connects like this. And you, you have to push this all the way. Uh, and you may need to slightly move this to the side. As this, like this, so it's sitting like this and you have those two parts here that go in on the way there should be a documentation to show this process I'm just making this video just in case so here it is and place the figure you may remove this whole section connect the figure to this and just move it in and out like this but if you don't need this uh, very secure, to be very secure, you can place uh, Xavier Professor X here. There should be enough room for his legs. So I know he is not sitting all the way, but this part can be changed if needed. So if someone has a problem with this, I can make uh, this uh, to make a sec separate part and just send the file. Uh, so okay, Gambit is sitting, like I said, he can be secured using some kind of a string or something. Uh, and this is, this part goes in. So here he is. Uh, those things make for a hover effect, so from most angles uh, they shouldn't be visible and uh, because of the light now they are quite reflected but on the shelf they they, they catch the color of the background because they are transparent so uh, and it's supposed to make him hover so this is a tutorial on how to put this together uh, the look is based on uh, the cartoon version uh, but based on the cartoon version for a few episodes so because he looked different on different episodes I, I picked the ones that I think I like and made it like this uh, and uh, one more thing there's a small gap here I don't know if you can see it it's very very minor the project doesn't have it so I think that, that there might be some misalignment in the print just a very very tiny one and just to show you that this side doesn't have the gap so okay so uh, this is a uh, tutorial of how to put the Xavier chair together. Uh, thank you for watching this video. Uh, 
and if you enjoy it or have any questions please uh, put them in the comments so thank you and goodbye